Alright, here we go. Found my boy. My boy Magni. Travel to the Chamber of Heart and commune with Azra. So we've done it. That was the intro into BFA. Now we're going to go ahead and take over the Heart of Azra. Get that in. And I'll catch you guys then. You know about the Blood Trader? And yeah, I do. What about it? Alright, so Horde, just like the Alliance, have to get a artifact item that collects Azurite, which is like the main resource in um, BFA. So instead of artifact power, you get Azurite power, which gets stored into some Heart of Azeroth, which is a net piece, which is what we're about to do here. I've done this on the Alliance, now I'm not too sure if it's going to be different on the Horde. But location-wise, it's different than the Alliance. So let's go ahead and uh, do this. And see what it's all about. Ooh. I'm actually going to let this play because this has to do with it. How does this big massive monstrosity die? Like seriously, how the hell did we defeat this? This thing's bigger than Azeroth, the world itself. Like the freaking weapon, first of all. Like what, how did we do this? We're like ants compared to this dude. Like imagine going outside, seeing a pile of ants trying to raid you as a 25 man. What, what, what do you do? You just do your stomp, which has like no cooldown, and it's over. Like that guy, how did he just die? How did, how did he just lose? I still don't. Know. This makes no sense. Like Ragnaros, okay. Lish King, okay. Kill Jaden, okay. This. No. How? Gul'dan, okay, but this, no. How did we defeat that? Like, look at that thing, dude. It makes zero sense. I'm, I still don't get it. But that cinematic does have to do with the Heart of Azeroth, which is why I actually kept that in the video and played it. He didn't. I'm still saying it was an avatar that blinked out when he let go of the sword. I'll, I'll hold you to that one. I'll hold you to that one. So now we gotta speak to my boy Magni. So now it's another cinematic. She offers a gift. One born of her own essence. I may be her speaker, but you are her champion, and she needs you to fight for her. The very heart of Azeroth. 
I mean, it's a little bit different, I think. But that is the heart of Azeroth from the Horde point of view. We are now going to go ahead and um, absorb Azerite to empower the heart of Azeroth. Okay, so we're going to go ahead and uh, make our way over to BFA content. As you guys can see, we have it equipped. I feel this is different. I don't remember doing this at the Alliance side, but I, I'm gonna I'm gonna go rewatch that myself. So we gotta do this. We're gathering as the right power to a certain degree. And no, I did not. Yeah. Oh wait, no, no, no I didn't. I don't think I did. I don't think I did. Don't don't guarantee me on that, but I'm pretty sure I did. Use the to mend the seal. Which fucking seal are we trying to mend? This, right? Alright, I was close enough, there we go. Oh, we mending it boys? Get my men down, boys. Get my men down. Yeah, I I don't remember this. It does say horde quest, so. I'm pretty, I don't remember this on the Alliance side, but I don't see why the Alliance would have something different. No! The seal is shattering! Hold on, lass! Please, hold on! The chamber is secure! Damn straight! I'm gonna actually just take the crown and uh, start using that, and then speak with Nathanos. And as you guys can see, here is the crown of champion, which is our new helm. Where we can now... Would you shut up? Every quest line, you talk so much. But as you guys... Are you done? Well, hero, you've got work to do. The teleportation pad will take you back to your allies. Good luck to all of us. He's done. All right, cool. Um, but I've done this on the Alliance side. I've actually made a video about the Azerite power and how the uh, the user interface works. But um, yeah, pretty much you get to choose from these sets of rows, and uh, once you level up your Heart of Azeroth, you get to unlock more rows of tiers of that basically like talents to choose from which just basically are buffs none no they're all passive abilities um so the outer requires level one the inner requires level two and then the super inner requires level three you can also do this on the shoulders as well as your chest piece so uh wait out for that but you have to continue growing your heart of azeroth uh, power so champion of azeroth your spells and abilities have a chance to increase all secondary stats by 12 for one minute stacking up to four times or as a destruction warlock, when you emulate, deals periodic damage to a target above 80% health. Uh, again, 605 haste and flashpoint. Sounds pretty lit. So then it goes ahead and pinpoints that into where I am currently stuck with. There is an affliction version, sudden onset, and a demonology version, shadow spites. But since I am currently destruction, all I have to worry about is flashpoint and champion of Azeroth. And that is simply how. The uh, Azurite power works. Let's get back into Orgrimmar.